This past weekend, Lolly Ella Jewelry held a pop-up shop event at Sage Green Floral Shop in Kegel Harbor to display their products. We talked to co-owner Erica Strouch about how Lolly Ella started. So Lolly Ella started with my four sisters and my mom, and we always had a love for jewelry, and we always played with my grandmother's jewelry as kids. So as my youngest sister graduated from college, we came to the point that if we don't do something, we would like to do a small business, and because we love jewelry so much, it was a perfect opportunity. And we called the store Lolly Ella after our two grandmothers and our great grandmother. It's their names put together. So, and we really created Lolly Ella, not only because we enjoy jewelry, but we wanted to share our joy for jewelry with others, and in empowering women to feel better about themselves. By putting on a few accessories, it's amazing how you can take an outfit you wear all the time and just freshen up the look. Put a new scarf on, put a necklace on, put a pair of earrings on, and it makes you feel like a million bucks. And we just really wanted to build women's self-esteem and make them feel good about themselves, and that's what we thought accessorizing does for you. After 14 years at a brick and mortar store in Kiko Harbor, Erica told us about the process of transitioning their business over to an online store. So we transitioned from being a bricks and mortar store to online during the pandemic and um, it gave us an opportunity to be doing a lot of virtual stuff with our customers and being able to still have that personal touch and that personal guidance for accessorizing but to being able to do it virtually gives us another area to expand to other uh, clientele. A lot of our customers actually in the area moved out of state so being online gives them quick access for that and then all our social media with Instagram and Facebook gives us opportunities to be able to reach new um, opportunities. Their ability to host pop-up shops at Sage Green has made it easy to show their jewelry and other products to their customers in person. So Sage Green is a wonderful place to host pop-ups. It's a gorgeous flower shop and we love all her unique ideas and we are a wonderful pairing to do that with them. It gives us an opportunity to be able to showcase our small business in person and now being an online business it's nice for people to come see our jewelry and be able to accessorize in person. With the new year fast approaching, we asked Erica what is in store for Lolly Ella in 2022 and what the new year may bring their company online and in person. So we're looking forward to 2022 of continuing our pop-up circuit and being able to still have interaction with our customers, still do virtual stuff online because a lot of people still enjoy that too, and being able to have a greater presence here in the area. Through their love for accessorizing and family, the Strouch family has taken Lolly Ella to new heights since moving their small business online. As 2021 wraps up, Lolly Ella hopes that the greater West Bloomfield community can support them in shopping local in the new year. Reporting for The Splash, I'm Maddie Muschin.